The topic of this video is properties of tilted or slanted lines. Let's look at a problem. Find the equation of the line perpendicular to the line y equals 1 4th x plus 8 and passing through the point negative 6 comma 0. Okay, we've been asked to write the equation of a line, so we need to think our way through the flowchart. First we need to get a slope, then we need to get a point. Depending on the point's x coordinate, we'll either take the path to the left or to the right, and then if necessary, we'll re rearrange our equation to be in the correct final form. All right, first let's get our slope. The line that we have been given is this, and the line we have been asked for needs to be perpendicular. So we need to find the slope of the given line, which conveniently has been provided in slope-intercept form and therefore can be read from the equation, 1 fourth. And then we need to use that to find the slope of our line. Well, perpendicular lines have slopes that are opposite reciprocals of each other. So what is the opposite reciprocal of 1 fourth? Well, opposite means change sign from positive to negative or negative to positive. And reciprocal, in shorthand form, means flip it over. So I need to flip it over and change the sign. 1 over 4 becomes 4 over 1, which is 4. Change the sign, make it negative, negative 4. We now have the slope of our line. OK, slope done. Next, pick a point. Only one point was given in this problem, and it's negative 6. Pick a path, to the left or to the right. We look at the x-coordinate, and we find that it is not 0. That forces us to take the path to the right. So we're going to use the point-slope equation, y minus y1 equals m times the difference x minus x1, to write the equation of our line. So we get y minus, y1 is the y-coordinate of the point, which is 0, equals m, which for our line is negative 4, times x minus x1, which is the x-coordinate of our point. Subtracting a negative is the same as adding, and subtracting 0 means you're left with what you started with. So y minus 0 is simply y. Distribute the negative 4, and we get y equals negative 4x minus 24. This is our final answer for this problem.